Hey, today Chad is going to be doing all my voiceover for my makeup tutorial. So just disregard everything that he's saying because he knows nothing about makeup and everything he's saying is probably incorrect. So let's get started. Bye. That's my name. I do fashion, beauty, and DIY. Welcome to my channel. So today I'm gonna do some makeup. As you can see, I'm already supernaturally beautiful. I don't even need makeup. Life's tough. What can I say? So here I'm doing some pore stuff. I'm gonna fill in my pores because you want to be sure to always clog up those pores for the best look. And now we're gonna put Fit Me, uh, shake it up, shake it up, just like you'd shake up a can of paint. Got my little sponge ball here. This is the SpongeBob SquarePants version. Gives you that real cartoony effect. Now all those imperfections that weren't there to begin with are even gone more. Now here I got my cabrow, which is gonna fill in my eyebrows because my eyebrows are, oh, just a little not on fleek today, but bam, look at that. Looks like I've been taking Rogaine for my eyebrows now. New dude, it's uh, makeup for dudes who are naked, but you know, it works well for females too. So I got my little buki brush here. I like the white guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and choose that color. Put it on my eyes, because I always got my eye out for guys. But you know, I like guys of all colors, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna get a mix here going on. Is that a ballpoint pen? What the heck? That is weird, okay. Uh, anyway, uh, let's fill that in a little bit with another brush called the Eye Blender brush. Now you gotta be careful with this under eye makeup. You, can, you wanna get a happy medium between natural and the black eye look. Back to the top of my eyes. Uh, let's, cho let's choose this orange color here. This color's name is the Donald Trump. And just gotta put on layer number seven now on my eyes. The more layers, the better. Uh, you know, you've seen the 100 layer challenge on YouTube probably. Let's just keep going here. I'm gonna choose the color right from this guy's crotch area there. Because in the beginning, I used that sponge to get rid of all my imperfections. So now I gotta put those imperfections back in manually. There we go. And now I'm choosing the pasty white color. It reminds me of my husband. Now we have the Jower Eye Pen. It's uh, really good for putting on your eyelashes, kind of where they connect to your eye. Gives you that super trendy ring around the eye look. Now we're gonna add a little, uh, little cattail here to make my eye look even bigger. And now we get to my other eye. My other eye is a little bit lazy, so I'm gonna make this one pop a little bit by giving a real good upward swirl here. <laughs> Just kidding me. <laughs> All right, let's keep finishing this eye here. Give that little cattail again. Yeah, no, nope, make it a little bit longer. Yep, 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 yep. Now, ooh, look at, look at me. I love looking at myself. <laughs> okay, we got the eyelash curler. You wanna be real careful with this because one quick swoop and you could rip all your eyelashes out. That would be horrible. Give it a couple pumps. Pump it up, pump it up, pump, pump. Hold it, hold it for like 30 seconds. Here we have X-rated, because that porn star look is really in right now. Go ahead and apply it to your lashes. This is called mascara, that's it. And keep on going. Try not to leave any clumps in your eyelashes, that ain't good. And be sure to give some attention to your lower lashes, because what must go up must go down. Damn, I'm so impressed with myself. Here we have the Bye Bye Under Eye, because those bags that I don't have under my eyes, just gotta get rid of those. Make sure to apply them in a happy face shape and then blend it in with your sponge. Any sponge will do. Just grab one from your kitchen sink and you're good to go. And look at me. Oh, be sure to whisper some sweet nothings to yourself and give yourself encouragement. And grab a paintbrush, suck those cheeks in because that fish face is all the rage this season. And the higher you make your cheekbones, there's a scientific equivalent to how many thumbs up you'll get on Instagram. Now I need to draw on my nose just because it's already so small. Let's put a little emphasis on it here. Definitely want to add some definition to the ridges because a well-defined nose lets people know that you know about noses. Here we have another pen that you, it's a lip pen that you add to your lips edges. Well-defined lips really make people listen to you more. You'll notice if you do a really good job, people will pretty much do whatever you say. Here we have the Kylie Kardashian lipstick. And we're gonna go and put that on. Really big lips are in this season. Just the thicker, the plumper, the better. Watch out though, next season they're gonna be uh, small lips. They're gonna be really cool. So just make sure to pay attention to trends. 
Half of this is uh, see-through the makeup, but I'm not gonna use that, I'm gonna use this pink makeup here. Brush that back on the cheekbones. What did I say about cheekbones earlier? You gotta have those high cheekbones. Circular blending, circular fashion, guys. And here we have some blush, cause the look when you go <laughs> is really, really hot, but you don't wanna be doing that all day, so you can just kind of fake it with this makeup. Ooh, fake it with this makeup. All right, let's do a couple more layers of eyes because I didn't put on enough last time. Oh, I wasn't very happy with that. Let me erase that. There we go, fix that right up. And I just want to let you guys know that all of today's makeup is gluten-free and vegan-free and no animal testing was done except for on men, actually. Uh, we tested the makeup on men to see if they would break out in hives or rashes. Okay, and now it's three hours later. The event I was supposed to go to has passed, so it's time to go to bed and take this makeup off. So here is the completed look. This is a very easy, natural makeup look that is perfect for the laid back girly girl. So if you like this look, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more fashion, beauty, and DIY videos. I hope you guys enjoyed this video of Chad overdubbing me. Have a wonderful day and I will see you next time. Bye!